This unlocks such an amazing feeling for me. Most feared means Halloween. Halloween means Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving means Christmas. There is nothing I love more than the next three months. And what an amazing way to kick this off. So the most feared promo is in Madden. It looks as dope as ever. And honestly, the last three weeks, I have been so discouraged about EA. Things were looking horrible for Ultimate Team, the execution, the rewards. It was embarrassing. But I'm not gonna lie. Some of the rewards right now with this season two update look incredible. So there's a most feared field pass, which you can get tons of most feared stuff on, experience and coins. And I couldn't believe this shit when I saw it. But the season two field pass, okay? There's a 92 overall Josh Allen. And this, I couldn't believe this right here. All right, it's lagging like a bitch. Okay, so it's still EA. So take what you can get. But 94 overall corner, Deion Sanders completely free. This will be one of the best corners in the game for the next three months. Obviously, it's deep in the field pass, but holy shit. And this gives us a little rundown of most feared. Your most feared players will be boosted during versus CPU matches until November 3rd. So at first I saw that and I was like, darn it, I can't use any of my boosted players against people in head-to-head. -head. However, there is a house rules, which I'm absolutely playing today, called Field of Fear. X-Factors are always on and the monster morphs are active, which I believe means every single most feared player is boosted. I think the best way for us to go into most feared is just to dive right in. And it's been like two months since I've opened packs. I'm actually really excited. I'm most likely gonna go with this most feared elite bundle because it has two 90 overall most feared players as the topper. So we're guaranteed two amazing players. I don't know what players are in most feared. It's my favorite way to go into a promo. Just go in. Also, I'm excited to share with you guys my absolute favorite life hack. What if I told you I could get you cash back on things that you're already buying? That's the magic of the Upside app. I want to show you how simple it is. So what Upside does is it gives you cash back for essentials. Gas, groceries, dining out, and it doesn't cost anything. It's actually insane how simple it is. Now, I love to use the Upside app for getting gas. For example, it's got this gas station near me where I can get 46 cents per gallon back for doing literally nothing other than opening the upside app. I'm going to click on it and I'm going to select claim offer. Now all I do is head to the gas station, pay like I normally would with a credit or debit card and I get cash back in the upside app. It is so simple. It's amazing. You can cash out anytime your bank account, PayPal, e-gift card, whatever's easiest for you. And that's literally it. Probably the smartest decision I ever made and it's a completely free app. Here's how you get started. Number one, download the free upside app in the app store or Google Play. Do not forget to use my promo code math you M to get $5 or more cash back on your first purchase of $10 or more. So extra free money. Then you claim an offer like I showed you. Check in at the business. That's it. Upside is amazing. Click that link in the description. I know you guys are going to love this and enjoy the rest of the video. I'm actually going to start out with whatever this is, this little tear rung thing. EA, I'm finally giving you money after a long time. All right. So that goes so hard. Dude, I, the, the pack animation guy alone has convinced me to spend so much money on these games over there. Damn, I got a Minka too. Get a little coins on the account and a Kenyan green. Now it's a six times most feared bundle, so I just get most feared packs. These most feared packs do not guarantee a single elite player. They're just 78 pluses or better. So any elites, I'm a happy man. Dude, that animation goes so hard. It kind of reminds me of like a scary movie, you know? And Jerry Tillery, all right. Last year it was like bats, you know, it was like Halloween theme. This is more like scary movie. That goes hard. <gasps> Cooper Rush got a card. It's my father. That might just be my quarterback. Let's promote him to starter right now so I don't forget. This will demote Josh Allen. Hmm. Do I want to demote the second best QB in the league for the first best QB in the league? Hmm. Another elite. Two elites. I'm not getting any elite most feared, but I am getting elite, so that's good news. No, I do know that there is a limited Stefan Gilmore. Stefan Gilmore? Ooh, Melvin Ingram. Ooh. Zandy! Zandy Horvath! Bro, all the fucking goats are getting a card. Zandy Horvath. Zandy Horvath is our base fullback in Wheel of Mud. Step three is a 90 plus overall most feared hero or champion. What are the odds? Does it tell me? So we're guaranteed a 90 plus, but we have a 4.8% chance at a 92 plus. Ooh. Come on, baby. Can we do it? Can we do it? Can we do it? Oh, oh that's sick. 
There's a Hutch? Dude, I still got my Aiden Hutchinson poster in here somewhere. That's sick. You know, it's not the 92, but 90 overall Aiden Hutchinson, a six foot seven right end with 83 speed. I didn't realize he was six foot seven. So then what's step four? A 92 overall most feared fantasy champion. Now you're talking. So I'm guaranteed one of the 92s. There's no different pack animation. It's gotta be my biggest pack. Oh! I got the limited. Oh, fuck. Oh my God, wait. <laughs> I didn't realize that that was a possibility. And Derrick Henry. Bro, the limit. Here's the thing. I want Derrick Henry, but this Gilmore has got to be way more expensive. This is probably one of the most expensive cards in the game. Dude, and he's got the animation bubbling up. Oh my God. Dude, this Derrick Henry gets bruiser, goal line back, and tank all for one AP each. I'm going to go Gilmore, and then I'm just going to get Derrick Henry from the sets or from something else. I feel like I can get Derrick Henry. Let's see the stats on this thing, though. So he quick sells for 350k, which is awesome. 92 speed, 6 foot 1, 91 excel. The best corner in the game. Although Tariq Woolen from the field pass is like 6'4", but I still think this Gilmore is probably the best corner. Got yes, cobwebs sir. on it, dude. This shit goes so hard. There is a reroll for a 78 plus overall most feared player, and I'll probably probably do that on stream on Twitch, but I'm not going to bore you guys with a thousand uh -huh. rerolls right now. Let's just do the most feared elite bundle. Look at our team in the sets. I want to hop into this field of horror or whatever that thing was called. What is this? What is this? What is this? Jalen Johnson, 84 Greg Gaines. That's a solid. Oh, it's a most feared elite pack. So I'm guaranteed to the elites this time around. Connor McGovern, Kenneth Murray, Andrew Van Ginkle, Dre Greenlaw. I'm excited to see like everything that is available. Tyrod Taylor, McGovern again, Hollywood. Uh, da, da, da. Most feared. Yeah, he's most feared of a primetime football game. I guess that's why they gave him one. I, I don't know what to say about that. Dude, what am I doing? Kirk Cousins went to Michigan State. I can't talk shit about my boy. Derek Stingley with an 84. Well, deserved. He's been a monster, dude. Kenyon Green, Jerome Bettis, Mercedes Lewis, AJ Dillon, a full elite pack. We take those. Ryan Suckup, Jelani Tyvai, Jadevian Clowney. Of course Clowney gets one, bro. Clowney is one of those dudes who has like actually been so like mid in the league for the last couple years, but EA just keeps slurping him off. Like, hey, good for him. He gets a nasty card Madden every year, but I feel like I don't actually hear about Jadevian Clowney outputting qu high quality real life football results. Can I just pull Derrick Henry so I don't feel bad about taking Gilmore? Clowney again. Cameron Fleming. That's a Denver Bronco. Most uh -huh. feared of scoring in the red zone. I wouldn't say this is anything crazy. Mercedes Lewis. McCole Hardman. This card's got to be nasty, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> you bet your ass. I'm picking that up in double or nothing. 88 speed, 5 foot 10, 84 overall. That's disgusting. All right, my next pack is the 290 overall most feared champion player. So I don't think this can be 92s because it's just 90 overall. It doesn't say 90 plus. Got a dupe already. Tough. I'll end up just selling him so we can pick up somebody else. We get Garrett Bowles, another Denver Bronco. I think I'm going to sell both of these guys. Actually, no. I feel like the Garrett Bowles could be really nice. So I'll hang on to him, but I am going to sell Hutch. I'm going to do one more of these bundles. Let's see if we can pull some heat on this next one. And then I'm ready for sets. Let's get it. Chris. All right. We already started out way hotter. EJ Speed, John Simpson, Chris Jones, and who's going to be the final? Come on. Keep it strong. Keep it strong. Keep it strong. John Johnson. Derek Stingley, John Johnson, Boston oh, Scott. I thought he was a pro Rocket League player. What's he doing in my NFL game? Christian Fulton, McCall Hardman, Kenyon Green, Mason Cole. All right, all right. Blackman, McGovern, AJ Green's got. Oh, I got an AKA player. Probably just one of the lows. 82 Fitzpatrick, AJ Green's got an 87. Charles Cross and Van Ginkle, Jared Stidham, Derek Stingley. Mid. We're having a mid off in these packs right now. Mercedes Lewis, Noah Brown, McCall Hardman. Come on, Curtis Samuel, Bud Dupree. He's got an 87. That's probably a very nice linebacker card. His gold is good. Hollywood! I got the Hollywood. Let's go. Wait, he's got to be kind of nasty too, dude. His core elite has crazy good speed. 90? With 90 deep route run. Holy shit. Yo, this card's nasty though. Let's go. 90 speed. This is our final pack before the next topper. We get an all mad player though. 82 Warren Sapp, Jalen Johnson, Greg Gaines, and Brett Kern. All right, and then back to the topper. There's got to be some crazy 90s, right? Mike Kosicki. Oh, that's going to go so hard. Mike Kosicki and Shaq Griffin. Both of these are huge. This Shaq Griffin's 
nuts. Look at Mike Kosicki too, dude. This Mike Kosicki is going to be nasty. 85 speed, 91 spectacular catch, 6 foot 6, 250. Someone needs to dethrone Donald Parham. Hopefully it's this Kosicki right here. So let's sort by program most feared. So to get a 92 overall most feared champion, you need three of the 90s, which I do have. So right now I could redeem Harold Carmichael, who is the tallest wide receiver of all time. So he would actually, he would be insane. Julius Peppers. Holy shit, there's a Julius Peppers. Oh, I love Julius Peppers. I can view the Julius Peppers before getting it. That's savage. 92. Oh my, oh my God. He's so good. Dude, those are like wide receiver stats. 88 speed. Ooh, there's a Derwin James. I was this close to prestiging Derwin James. I was so close. Remember when I, remember when I took Micah Hyde out and put in Palomalu? I almost did Derwin James instead. All right, this Derrick Henry is who I want though. I'm not even gonna lie. I want this Derrick Henry. 90 speed, 91 break tackle, 92 truck, six foot three, 255. That is completely and utterly unfair. No other way to put it. That is unfair. Remember last year's most feared Derrick Henry? How much bullshit I pulled off of that card? Is this is round two right here? Ooh, there's a Debo. Awesome one to get. Debo, Shaq Griffin, Garrett Bowles, Hutchinson, Roquan Smith, Mike Gasicki. I kind of want Debo. Okay, so 487s and 284s gets me a Debo. A small uh -huh. price to pay for salvation. 90 overall Debo with 89 speed. It looks like 88 plus everything else. He's at 90 spec. And I think I could get another 90 overall so that we could use it for the most feared Derrick Henry set. And I do want to take a peek at this Roquan Smith and I have just enough to do so. I believe I have every 90 overall now. Yeah, I have every single 90 overall now. Roquan Smith is six foot 87, 91 XL with 87 hit power, 91 tackle. I would say he's a good user, but linebackers don't animate Madden. So you would be forced to give Roquan Smith lurker if you wanted to user him. And even then, he's still only six foot. So it is kind of a bummer. As a true linebacker, I'm sure he's amazing, but it's so sad. I'm literally better off using Derwin James as my middle linebacker than a Roquan Smith. And with all that done, we can unlock one player. I'm probably gonna do another video on Most Feared. I don't wanna drop everything on you guys at once, but I have Gilmore on defense, right? So I feel like on offense, I should go Derrick Henry. The only other player I want, so now in hindsight, I should have taken Derrick Henry because I want Derwin James. I'm actually gonna finesse away to make Gilmore my user. That's what I'm gonna do. All right, so we have to trade in some 90s to make this happen though, right? So what 90s do we want to trade in? We've got an extra Aiden Hutchinson. And then we got to decide out of a lot of players that I like here, man. I want to keep Aiden Hutchinson. I love him. I want to keep Debo. I want to use him. I want to use Mike Gesicki. I already have Gilmore, so we don't need Shaq Griffin. And we'll go Roquan Smith. That way, Derrick Henry can run behind Garrett Bowles. And this looks like it lagged too. Like, what is this, EA? What are you doing? Why'd you partition my screen? What, what even is this? Why am I... I also definitely want to give Garrett Bowles post up. This Garrett Bowles is crazy good. He has four ability slots. I could give him edge protector, but that's not what I want. I want post up. So Shatley Garrett Bowles will have what they need. Mike Gesicki. Can I just give you red zone threat and call it a day? He gets tight end apprentice. Oh, that's massive, especially since my quarterback's going to be Cooper Rush. That's actually huge. He could get red zone threat. It's 3 AP. Probably not worth it. Let's just give him double me because X factors are active the entire time in this house rules. That's big time. Derrick Henry, we're definitely loading up. So he's going to get freight train for sure. That's going to be his ability. But now, what do you get here? So he goes, this is fucked up. This is so fucked up. He gets three of the best abilities. Normally, these each of these abilities, three AP, you get to choose one for one AP. I think I'm going to go tank and bruiser. No goal line back. You better ankle bite the entire game or you're going to get ran through. And we have two AP to use on Debo if we choose. I say we just go double me Debo. So we have two double me's on the field. I don't even think he could utilize any of these abilities very well. No, he can't. You know what? Let's just do that. I think Aiden Hutchinson should absolutely have edge threat. So let's just knock that out. And we'll give him unstoppable force so that he can fly down. Edge threat under pressure, Aiden Hutchinson. That is going to be a scary thing coming off that edge like that. Gilmore's too nasty not to give an ability to. Like, he's just too good. I'm gonna give him universal coverage. Tip drill for zero? Literally free. That does imply that I'm not taking a one AP pick artist, which is usually two. Tip drill doesn't really work like they catch tip passes anyway you don't really need it 5 ap for acrobat acrobat is so good don't think it's worth 5 ap outside shade or inside shade not a big fan of either i can't justify 5 ap on acrobat so we're just gonna leave it as is now since i'm not getting derwin james there is a card i really want it's this cj gardner johnson 87 overall with 88 speed and 89 excel we finally hit that point in the season where some of these like relative budget players are actually nasty good like 60k i know that's not budget, but 
like, you got kids spending 1.2 mil for their strong safety or free safety. So this is budget. Roquan Smith, do you get Lurker for 2 AP? I don't know what a pass coverage middle linebacker gets and for what price. <gasps> Holy shit, his fourth slot is Lurker for 1 AP. EA knew exactly what I was going to bitch about with this card, and they corrected it. That's amazing. That is so good. And I'm going to be honest, if your X Factor starts on, I need to go Avalanche here. I'm going to be using Roquan Smith everywhere across the field. If I can get a downhill hit stick, I will force a fumble. Don't let the ghouls and haunts keep you out of the end zone. Unleash you your that? inner monster. Whoa, whoa, whoa. With always on X Factors and mash your opponent. All right, I'm done. All right, so to win, you need to take a lead of 15 plus points. It's 15 yard first downs. You gotta love this requirement. Don't allow your opponent to win. Whatever, I'm just gonna play. I don't know how this works. Cooper Rush back there with Derrick Henry. Gesicki, Debo Samuel, his X Factors. He's got Melvin Ingram, Talanoa, Hufanga. All right. Ooh, Debo just torched his man. That might be a touchdown first play. Dude, that's the night train lady. He torched him. Let's go. Derrick Henry, easy. Cooper Rush, two for two. Eight points, up early. Ooh, and there's Aiden Hutchinson, there's Roquan Smith, and there's Gilmore. He's got Brady. I'm on this, though. I'm on this, though. Where are you throwing? This game is over. Shaq Griffin. This game's over. He might just quit. I would. I'm gonna go Gesicki here. Torched his man. And he's got double me, so... <laughs> he's so fucked. Gonna go play action. I'm lobbing Debo. Oh, my God. He torched this guy again. <laughs> and he caught it. <laughs> Let's go! Jeez. Brand new game. Let's see if we can uh, reset everything here. That was a... Cooper Rush just threw a fucking mallet. He's going to score on the first play of the game because of that. When you're hot, you're hot. When you're cold, you are cold. Sheesh. He threw it back shoulder and up the field. Couldn't have been worse. All right, let's see if he runs this. I'm going to stuff it with Ronnie Lott if he does. He just uh -huh. hurdled the fucking line. I hit that gap too, but he cut back real nice. Look at this, dude. I filled that with Ronnie Lott, but great cutback by him. All right, let's go McCall Hardman. Hey, great throw. That's what we need right there. That's a beauty. Fuck it. Ooh, Debo's got the beat on it too. Oh! Talk to me! Debo Samuel! Return to sender. We're back on the board. All right, we can turn things around. Look at that throw from Cooper, dude. Damn, way to keep your feet in too, Debo. All right, I am, I'm throwing a toss to Derrick Henry. He's just got to beat a corner. Oh, actually, a Quayle block. Come on, baby! It's Derrick Henry right there. You knew Derrick Henry was going to do that. Eight to eight. Wow, we're 38 seconds into this game. It's eight to eight. Heater. Mm. Fred Warner, eat him up. I see everything right now. He doesn't have anything. Wait, avalanche, avalanche, avalanche. Oh, I knew I had a lot of field to cover. I almost could have switched off and then switched back on, but that would have been pretty beta. So I'm happy with what I did. Third and 15. Fred Warner. Fred Warner's doing more than Hutch right now. Sheesh. Don't know what he's looking for, but Hutchinson is back there. Now we take our lead. Now we take our lead. Inside zone split. Doesn't look to be a lot of room, but I think if I'm gonna run the ball, I need to run stretch against this defense, I believe. Let's go. Right through Ted Hendricks. Not through the next one. Third and 12. <laughs> Shoot. I can't get the run game going. We obviously also have to go for it. Debo. Debo. No. Ooh, nice play. I did. I thought Cooper Rush should throw it over that. Grant Delphi yoinked it. Debo had him too. Debo had him torched. Right here, right here, right here, right here. Oh, that's fine. Gardner. Oh, Gardner Johnson was so close, but we didn't hang on to it. That tight end's open. Shit. I think he's in. It's a hornet. Nice play. I couldn't keep up with him, Roquan. This is fine. We like this. He's coming up on the two minute warning. I like that. I like that. Oh, uh -huh. damn. I thought we'd be able to cover that ground. I don't like that. We got to stop this, though. We got to stop this right here. He's going to throw right across my face. Let's go. Let's go. That's huge. All right. We just got to get in the end zone in a minute 57. Like, I really want to believe in Derrick Henry here. Okay. He's peeling off with the D tackle. Damn. I could have gotten a lot more out of that. All right. Dude, it's literally the fear monger. Look at these fucking throws. It must be because Cooper Rush is such a low overall that he just can't even throw a decent ball. I love Cooper Rush, but damn, it's hurting me right now. I'm gonna double team over there. Hopefully that helps. I got Hardman up the seam. I got Gasicki up the seam. Hardman, I need you, buddy. Finally throw a good pass, and this one is defended. Wow, that sucked, man. He can just run the ball out now. Wow, that sucked. Cooper, you let me down there. Their first play of the game, he throws a pick six.
Ooh, Michael Vick, Eric Dickerson. That's a slip screen. I'm on Hutch. Big boy. Second and 12. Damn. A read option. Nice run. He ran that great. Vick hang on to the... Oh, does he have Truz on? If he has Truz on, that makes sense. He has Freight Train on Michael Vick. I'm going to be honest. I didn't even know you could do that. I think this is obviously a run of some variety. Pop! Oh, what a play. He ran the read option. He ran the triple option. That was so sick. I'm not even mad. Dude, what a playbook. This guy's a sav. That was not a good throw, though. He had a wide open wide receiver. Now I'm sad. This playbook was really cool, and he goofed it, man. He goofed it. Let's go have that cross screen. This is like one of the weird ones. It's gun bunch, so everybody expects some fucking gun bunch shenanigans. Yeah, see, look at him peeling off. But Cooper Rush... Dude, I literally have nothing but fucking daylight. Cooper Rush is so bad. Why did I do this, dude? I love you, Cooper Rush, but I don't love you this much. All right, Derrick Henry. Dude, he can't fucking throw. Hey, we got that one off. At least we have a shot at catching it. We don't, but that was better than our first two throws. So that's the best odds we've had all day. I'm gonna go Gesicki on the slant. So hopefully he takes it. Ah, whatever. I'll just punt. That was my version of a punt right there. I would've got sacked and then had nothing. Oh, what a loser. Oh, we like those. You can throw at Ramsey. Shit. Dickerson just made an awesome tackle. All right, well, it's, it's turnover for a turnover. I'm looking for Debo. Debo's got to bail me out right now, dude. I'm, we're struggling to do anything. Hey! Oh, my God, Debo. Bail me the fuck out. I love you. Let's go. That's what we need. Cooper Rush. Oh, he's gone. Bro, this guy has the best players in the whole game, and he's gone. All right, Cooper Rush got his confidence back. That's what we needed. All right, boys, awesome game to end it on. Pull up the Twitch if you want to see more. I'm going to be doing a ton of this on Twitch. This is so much fun. I go in and out of doing Twitch. If I'm having a ton of fun, I do it. If I'm not, I don't. It's pretty simple. Hope you guys loved the video. This was a blast. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.